वेलकम टू आवर टू डेज वीडियो लेक्चर ऑन कमेंसरेबल नंबर हैव यू एवर वंडर हाउ सम नंबर्स कैन बी नीटली कंपेयर एंड अंडरस्टूड थ्रू सिंपल फैक्शन दैट्स द मैजिक ऑफ कमेंसरेबल नंबर सो गेट रेडी टू अनलॉक द सीक्रेट्स कनेक्शन बिटवीन द नंबर्स विद आवर थ्रिलिंग एक्सप्लोरेशन ऑन कमेंसरेबल नंबर इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल एक्सप्लोर वट कमेंसरेबल नंबर्स आर वाई दे मैटर्स एंड हाउ दे हैव बीन यूज थ्रू आउट द हिस्ट्री so let's dive in and uncover the secrets of the special number commensurable mean common measure common measure in mathematics two non zero real numbers a and b are said to be commensurable if their common ratio a ratio b is rational number so here real numbers real numbers i draw a real line zero positive numbers on the right side all the negative numbers on the left side of zero so all non zero numbers all non zero mean excluding zero positive numbers and all negative numbers excluding zero the ratio between a and b ab may be real number any real number it may be rational number it may be whole number it may be Uh, integer the ratio between two commensurable two numbers is said to be commensurable if their common ratio is rational number otherwise a and b are called incommensurable number so first of all we recall the definitions of rational number what are rational number all the number that are written in the form of p by q where p q belongs to integers p q may be negative may be positive but q not equal to 0 q not equal to zero. All these number of the type p by q, where q not equal to zero and p q belong to integers, are called rational numbers. So, if we get the common ratio of two numbers, a rational number, then we we can say that these this is commensurable number. If the common ratio between a and b is not a rational number, then we can say this is incommensurable number. Let's have some example. If we write four ratio eight, its simple form is so the common ratio of these number is one by two. We get one by two, the common ratio one by two, which is a rational number. This number is a rational number because p is equal to one, q is equal to two, and q not equal to zero. P and q both belong to integers. So these a and b, these two number a and b are commensurable number. We can say that four and eight are commensurable number. Another example. Let's the ratio between circumference of circle two pi r and diameter of circle, which is Two R, which is equal to pi, which is irrational number. So the common ratio between two numbers, two pi R and two R, is a irrational number. That is pi. So we can say that pi is irrational number. And these two values are incommensurable. Similarly, we can say that under root two is also incommensurable number. so commensurable number tell us how the numbers are connected how they compare with each other 